Hello, my name is Brian Casey, Editor-in-Chief of AntMedia.com. We're here at the J.P. Morgan Healthcare Conference in San Francisco. If you're not familiar with it, J.P. Morgan brings together the investment world with lots of uh, great technology. It's happening right up the street. Wait a minute, what's this? Excuse me, sir. Let's take a closer look at this. Hi there. Brian Casey with AntMini.com, how are you? I'm Khan Siddiqui, Chief Medical Officer and Chief Strategy Officer of Hyperfine. Hyperfine, what's Hyperfine? It's the first, world's first portable point of care MR scanner. All right, well let's take a closer look. So tell us a little bit about the Hyperfine scanner. Sure, so the team has been working for the last five years to really solve the access issues and cost issues on MR scanner. So look at the whole scanner from top to bottom, all the way from the magnet design to the electronics, to the RF shielding aspect of it and solve all the problem with a lot of IP built all in-house. Um, idea really was to how do we get democratized medical imaging, get it anywhere, any place, anytime that is needed. Yeah. Not only in the US, but the rest of the world. If you think about 90% of the world, world does not have an MR scanner and the biggest cost is not just the cost aspect of it, but the access aspect of it, and that's what we're trying to solve. Because MR machines are these big, hulking, you know, big iron scanners and you've got to take the patient to the scanner, you're you're now taking the scanner to the patients. Absolutely, the whole idea here is that this is like a portable machine that goes right next to the patient bedside. The patient can be slid in and have the imaging done right away uh, through a simple iPad-based interface that wirelessly talks to the scanner. Okay. Now this system is designed for head use, correct? So today our initial applications are for neuro applications that we've submitted to FDA. We plan to release other body applications in the future. Okay. And so you wheel the system right up to the to the patient, do the scan, uh, and then what happens? So we're actually looking at not just as a hardware aspect of it, but software application on top of it. So providing AI-based, uh, uh, easy way to scan the patient. We have um, optical motion detectors in the scanner, so if a patient moves during the scan, we know the case space elements that have been uh, distorted by the motion, and we can recorrect and resample at the same time without waiting for the scanner to end. And um, we and also focusing on building application that can identify pathology earlier on and give indication to person scanning right away. So you're not delaying diagnosis and treatment for the person. Okay. Now is this scanner, is this commercially available right now? Can you see this in a no, hospital now? We are, uh, we are still under IRB based research use today, pending uh, FDA 510K approval. We're hoping to get the approval in the first half of this year and then okay. go to commercial production next half of, later half of this year. Great. And you're here at JP Morgan talking to investors, looking to get some some funds? We are trying to raise a Series D round um, okay. and talking to a lot of investors, seeing a lot of interest. All right, Khan, well, good luck. Thanks for being with us. Thank you very much. All right, signing off for AntMini.com. My name is Brian Casey.